Hey, what's up foodies and welcome to Moroccan Food Tour Cooking Show. Today, we're making lamb tagine with green peas in artichoke. Well, this is a very famous tagine here in Morocco. In fact, those veggies are in season right now. Green peas, artichoke. A great combination, really to die for. It's a very easy, simple recipe, so it doesn't need that much time for preparation and a little passive time of one hour while it's cooking. So without any further talk, let's dig right into it. It's a very easy recipe. First of all, let's start with putting some marinade to the lamb. Garlic goes first, a little bit of salt, one spoon of black pepper, one spoon of turmeric, one spoon of chili powder, or cayenne powder, and one spoon of this special Ras Al Hanout. So Ras Al Hanout is a unique Moroccan mixture of spice. It contains more than 40 spice, and literally if you want to translate a Ras Al Hanout, it's gonna be the top of the shop, or like the best that you can find on a shop. Then we're adding some of the coriander and we're mixing everything. Of course, I will mix the spices first with the lamp and then I will add some olive oil because if we add the olive oil in the beginning, the spices were not gonna stay on the meat. Then we're chopping some onions. I have here two medium sized onions and then put that in the tagine. And let's put that on the stove with a bit of salt again some coriander black pepper and another spoon of turmeric give it a nice stir and now time to put our meat there cover it with the lid and let's start working on our artichoke we're using just the heart of the artichoke, so we're uh, taking away all the nibs and all the outside thing. From time to time, don't forget to stir your lamp. And once you start hitting that nice sizzling, add a nice cup of hot water to the tagine. Here I'm using some of the saffron. So I'm putting a little bit of saffron in my cup of hot water and then pouring everything in my tagine. Of course we don't want to bring down the temperature of the our, of our meat that's why we're adding hot boiling water and of course after that we lower the heat as much as we can while working on our artichoke. So once our artichokes are done, we can add, of course, our green peas. I'm going to level up a little bit the lamp. So like that, it's not gonna get stuck in the bottom and get burned. And we're adding our artichoke on top. And you can add also some water here. I just washed my the bowl that I marinated the uh, the the lamp in to not lose that flavor. Our tagine is ready after one hour of cooking in a very low heat. Oh yes, take a look at this bad boy. It looks really awesome. Oh my god, I cannot wait to dig in. Mm, yeah. Let us check those artichoke. They're very tender. Yes, the meat. Oh my God, take a look, like falling apart. 
that's it guys a wonderful tagine made out of some of the freshest ingredients that you can find in the market right now wonderful veggies very healthy the lamb mm, one of my favorite proteins and uh, yeah thank you guys for watching hit that like button comment down below what we should make next and subscribe to the channel like if you're not subscribed yet you're missing a lot let me tell you you're missing a lot of good stuff yeah subscribe all right thank you guys so much for watching this video and see you in the next one see you in the next one and see you in the next one okay let's give it a nice little taste mm. Oh my god. Wow. Mm-hmm. Like yeah, yeah. Well the, the the guy that made that combination, the first one, he should have a Nobel prize or something. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Wow. 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 Mm. Subscribe. If you, if you made it that far to the video, subscribe. Yeah, you, yeah, that's, that's what you have to do.